Alrighty, everybody, hello. Um, welcome back to Undertale. <laughs> okay, first I'm gonna go get some healing items. Right, gotta take the other elevator, because that one, that's the other one. Much faster this time. Oh, I gotta go all the way back. I can grab several of the parfaits. Those should work. I have money. I have some. So, I can uh, beat Asgore and then go to Azrael and do that fight. Oh, Azrael's fight is one of my favorites. I'm gonna try to get that all done in this part, um, and then I will take a break. Is that the capital? I should get if this is the capital or just like the kingdom. And here's where it starts to look like Toriel's. A little bit. Mm. A human fell into the ruins. Injured by the fall, the human called out for help. Azrael, the king's son, heard the human's call. He brought the human back to the castle. I'm as real as the human became like siblings. The king and queen treated the human child as their own. The underground was full of hope. Trophy, number one knows none of the way. Okay. Not as impressed with Asgore's room as people are always like, oh, yeah, yeah, it's everything. Human became very ill. The sick human had only one requirement. 
quest to see the flowers from their village. But there was nothing we could do. The next day, the next day, the human died. Azrael, wrecked with grief, absorbed the human soul. He transformed into a being with incredible power. With the human soul, Azrael crossed through the barrier. He carried the human's body into the sunset, back to the village of the humans. Ezreal reached the center of the village. There he found a bed of golden flowers. He carried the human onto it. Suddenly, screams rang out. The villagers saw Ezreal holding the human's body. They thought that he had killed the child. The human attacked him with everything they had. He was stuck with blow after blow. Ezreal had the power to destroy them all. But... Ezreal did not fight back. Clutching the human hair. Ezreal smiled and walked away. Wounded, wounded, Azrael stumbled home. He entered the castle and collapsed. His dust spread across the garden. The kingdom fell into despair. The kingdom and queen had lost two children in one night. Their humans had once again taken everything from us. Decided it was time for her suffering to end. Every human who falls down here must die. With enough souls, we can shatter the barrier forever. It's not long now. King Asgore. Let's go. That was too many voices to do all at once. You should be smiling, too. Aren't you excited? Aren't you happy? We are going to be free. This is Sansa's judgment. Hey, Sans. So you finally made it. The end of your journey is at hand. A few minutes, you will meet the king. Together, you will determine the future of this world. That's then, now, you will be judged. You will be judged for every action. You will be judged for every XP you have ever earned. What's XP? It's an acronym. It stands for Execution Points. Doesn't stand for that, it stands for experience points, but same difference. A way of quantifying pain you have inflicted on others. When you kill someone, your XP increases. When you have enough XP, your love increases. Love is an acronym too. It stands for level of violence. It's a way of measuring someone's capacity to hurt. The more you kill, the easier it becomes to distance yourself. The more you distance yourself, the less it will hurt. The more easily you can bring yourself to hurt others. But you, you never gained any love. Of course, that doesn't mean you're completely innocent or naive. Just that you kept a certain tenderness in your heart. No matter the struggles or hardships you faced, you survived to do the right thing. You refused to hurt anyone. Even when you ran away, you did it with a smile. You never gained love, but you gained love. Does that make sense? Maybe not. Now, 
you're about to face the greatest challenge of your entire journey. Your actions here will determine the fate of the entire world. You refuse to fight. Asgore will take your soul and destroy humanity. If you kill Asgore and go home, the monsters will remain trapped underground. What will you do? Well, if I were you, I would have thrown in the towel by now. But you didn't give up. Get this far by giving up, did you? That's right. You have something called determination. As long as you hold on, as long as you do what's in your heart, I believe you can do the right thing. Alright, we're all done counting on you, kid. Good luck. Gotta get my Asgore voice ready. Um, de -dee -dum. Oh, is someone there? Just a moment. I have almost finished watering these flowers. Here we are. Howdy, how can I... Oh. I so badly want to say, would you like a cup of tea? But, you know how it is. Nice day today, huh? Birds are singing, flowers are blooming. Perfect weather for a game of catch. You know what we must do? When we were ready, come into the next room. How tense. Just think of it like a visit to the dentist. Are you ready? If you are not, I understand. I am not ready either. <sighs> Let me make sure I'm gonna do this one. Okay. Make sure that I'm doing this right. <sighs> this is the barrier. This is what keeps us all trapped underground. If by any chance you have any unfinished business, please do what you must. I see. This is it then. Ready? Not over. And I'm ready.
I'm doing it too early. Still too early. <laughs> Why do I do it so early? Da, 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 da. There we go, much better. the other side. Interesting. Done. Okay. Okay, that was really aggressive. Okay. I got this. Okay. Okay. Okay, there we go, there we go. Okay, yeah, that's doing pretty good. That was a terrible hit, need to practice that a little bit more. That was sad. That was also sad. Glamburger. Oh. <sighs> 
Okay. That one's always so difficult for me. It's just so much all at once. Really difficult to pay attention. the wrong thing. Please. Okay. Nick. Okay, I need the apron on for the healing capabilities. I forget when it heals, but it does heal. Healing is good. <laughs> so, I'ma apply... Cause... Yeah... Every other turn. Every other turn, it will give me one HP, which is good. <sighs> okay, I can do this. <sighs> yeah, get rid of my mercy. Oh, that was terrible! That was terrible too. My burger. Yes. Okay. Okay. Dang it. Up.
idea how hard this is. Do I need more healing items? No. I need just to get better. Okay. 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 Need the apron on everything. Gotta put on the apron. So much all at once. Uh, Glamburger. Still good, still good. Congratulations, me. You played yourself. <laughs> uh, how did I mess up that badly? I know I can do this. I've done this before. Okay. He gets out the trident. Stabs my mercy. Okay, I don't have the apron on. Okay, this is gonna be a good one. Alright. Maybe not! Got too happy. So excited, I was like, I'm alive. Okay, start parfait. Cool, cool, cool. I'm okay with them.
know this looks so easy, but it isn't. <laughs> I still don't know how people focus during that one. That's so much, so much. Still move, move. Okay. Fight. A little bit on the tail there, but not bad, not bad. Move, 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 move. Perfect. Okay. Move still, move. Like my phone went off in the middle of stuff. I was like, ah, it's, you know, ah. Turns out it's just like one of my alarms. my last healing item. Whoa! Okay! <laughs> Finally did it! Oh, 15 HP left. Remember the day after my son died. The entire underground was devoid of hope. The future had once again been taken from us by the humans. In a fit of anger, I declared war. I said that I would destroy any human that came here. I would use their souls to become godlike and free us from this terrible prison. Then, I would destroy humanity, and let monsters rule the surface in peace. Soon, the people's hopes returned. My wife, however, became disgusted with my actions. She left this place, never to be seen again. Truthfully, I do not want power. I do not want to hurt anyone. I just wanted to have, to everyone to have hope. but. 
I cannot take this any longer. I just want to see my wife. I just want to see my child. Please, young one. This war has gone on long enough. Nobody has heard of your war on the surface, bud. Like, war? It's a weird word. You have the power. Take my soul and leave this curse in place. After everything I have done to hurt you, you would rather stay down here and suffer than live happily on the surface. Human, I promise you that as long as you remain here, my wife and I will take care of you as best as we can. We can sit in the living room, telling stories, eating butterscotch pie. We could be like, like a family. How's this going? You just got up from a nap? Well, Asgore died. <laughs> yeah, no, this is, you're like at the sad part where the dad dies, you know, happy Father's Day. <laughs> Goat dad went and got himself dead. <sighs> Shut up, Flower, you stupid ass. You haven't heard anything. <laughs> like, really? You came in at that moment? Um. Yeah, I'm finishing up the game. I'm at the last battle now, because all I have to do is fight Flowey. Um, and then I'll be done. I'll have beat it in a new record, because so far I'm at a little over 200 hours. If I'm able to make it to like half or a little above half, like less than three quarters of my old score, I'm going to be really happy. So Undertale closed for the first time, because that's what Flowey do. So now I open... And we open up Undertale again. Oh, shush, shush, you. Shush. There we go. That was fixed. Okay, I mean, no offense, bruh, but like. I'm done with this. Ah, yes. See, 264 hours. Or, er, 264 minutes, not hours. Minutes. <laughs> that was hours. Bro, I've been here a long time. Yeah, exactly. And I still have the last boss fight. So, if I'm able to do it in, like, less than 300, I'll be pretty happy. It's me, Flowey. Flowey the flower. I owe you a huge thanks. You really did a number on that old fool. Without you, I never would have gotten past him. But now, with your help, he's dead. And I got the human souls. Boy, I've been empty for so long. It feels great to have a soul inside me again. Hmm, I can feel them wriggling. Aw, you're feeling left out, aren't you? Well, that's just perfect. After all, I only have six. I still need one more before I become God. And then, with my newfound powers, monsters, humans, everyone, will show them all real meaning of this world. Oh, and forget about escaping to your old save file. They're gone forever. But don't worry, your old friend Flowey has worked out a replacement for you. I'll save over your own death. So you can watch me tear your you into bloody pieces over and over and over again. What? Do you really think you can stop me? <laughs> You really are an idiot. Okay. Hi, Flowey. Hey, all 
all dramatic with all this. Like, he more dramatic in Meta than Metaton in this one moment. Like, Metaton pretty dramatic. Like, oh my love, you leaving me, poor soul. Like, really? But then he's all like... That. <laughs> Okay, come on, Blue. Come on, baby Blue. <laughs> yes, heels. Ah, uh, yes, the flies. Bombs. I mean, NPC, you could make a game that looks like this. <laughs> These graphics. <laughs> <laughs> like, this has your style written all over. I'm sorry, but it does. Grab them all. I'll save, I'll save, I'll loaded, I'll save, I'll loaded. Okay, in the go, let's go. RTX. <laughs> healed. Nope, don't fight, don't fight, don't fight. Well, I mean, are you making a game with Photoshop? It's taking uh, free files and pre image files and turning them into like ch cheesy animations. Like this. We will determine. We will fight you. You will hurt them. We will determine. Freedom. Create happy mercy. Love. Success. Dream. Dreamer. <laughs> We will scream another day. I will hold on Okay, green. Let's go, green. Let's go, let's go. Ah, oh, yes, cooking. You, you gonna be a real estate determined. No, you gonna know how he goes. You can determine. Ah, yes, the bun. Wait a minute. 
It's not supposed to do that in Flower's thing! Oh yeah, there's this thing. It's really bright. It's really bright. And he crashed my game again. So I'm just gonna open it back up. I'll do that a couple times. Uh, he 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 Does he lose his ability to save? Did he lose his ability to save? Okay. Yellow? Yellow. Okay. I'll stay to Come on, Flowey. No. Make there no you Da 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 Determined, no, you will be there. No, you cannot win. I will stay determined. No, you will kill me. Yes, I want you. Do I have to kill him? Come on. Where did my flowy voice go? This can't be happening. 
happening. You, you. You idiot. <laughs> you really think? You could defeat me? I am the god of this world. And you? You're hopeless. Hopeless and alone. Golly, that's right. Your worthless friends can't save you now. Call for help, I dare you. Cry into the darkness. Mom, Daddy, someone help. We'll see what good that does you. You called out for help. Come on, goat mom. But nobody came. Boy, what a shame. No one else is gonna see you die. Goat mom. Goat mom. Goat mom. That's not goat mom. What? How did you... Well, I'll just... Uh, where are my powers? Oh, yeah, the human souls, not Goat Mom. Oops. Man, Goat Mom, Goat Mom, to me, is, like, the savior and the whole, like, reason the story. Like, everyone else, Goat Mom, thousand percent. <laughs> uh. Hi, Flowey. What are you doing? You really think I've learned anything from this? No. Sparing me won't change anything. Killing is the only way to end this. If you let me live, I'll come back. I'll kill you. I'll kill everyone. Kill everyone you love. Why? Why are you being so nice to me? I don't understand. I can't understand. I just can't understand. Flowey ran away. No! No! There's more to that! There's more! There, there's more! I know there's more. No, 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 Hold on, I know there's more to that. i played this before. Come on. Timmy Chang. Hi, I'm Timmy, and this is my friend Timmy. Hi, I'm Timmy, and this is my friend Timmy. Hi, I'm Timmy, and don't forget about my friend. Hi, I'm Bob. Like, when you have a unique name, that's exactly how it feels talking to absolutely anyone. It's like, doesn't, you feel out of place. Hey, uh, is anyone there? Well, I'll just leave a message. So, it's been a while. The queen returned, and now ruling over the underground. She instated a new policy. All humans who fall down here will be treated as not as enemies, but as friends. Probably for the best of you. Human souls the king gathered seems to have disappeared. So, uh, that plan ain't happening anytime soon. But even though people are heartbroken over the king, and things are looking grim for... Yes. The queen's trying to give us hope. So, uh, hey, if you're not giving up on here, don't give up on where you are, okay? Who knows how long it'll take. But we will get out of here. Sans, who are you talking to? Oh, nobody. What? Nobody? Can I talk to them too? Here, knock yourself out. Wait a second. I recognize this number. Hey, human! How are you doing? I'm doing fine. Well, besides the thing, the queen disturbs. 
disbanded the royal guard since we don't have to fight humans anymore. Wow, I have no idea what to do with my life, but that's okay because I am still working hard, even if it's on nothing at all. So don't feel bad. Papyrus is fine. Undyne is the one that's got her bad. She lost her job, then she lost her house. It was sad, but we were taking care of her. She's living on our couch now. She's like a sleepover every night. Sleepover, there's no escape room. Oh, we gave her a job too. Sans hired her, hired her at his illegal hot dog stand. She hates working there, but she makes a lot more than hot dogs. Oh yeah, she still blames you for the disappearance of Asgore. She talks to me a lot about getting revenge on you. She has a ludicrous plan to cross the barrier and beat you up. To be honest, I think it's impossible. But I'd like to believe it's not. Because I want you to go with her. And I get to see you again. Even if I'd have to fight you. Well, keep your fingers crossed. And keep in touch. I'll make our plans easier. Bye. Why? Why did you let me go? Don't you realize that being nice just makes you get hurt? Look at yourself. You made all these great friends, and by now you'll probably never see them again. Not even to mention that you've been set back because of you. It hurts, doesn't it? You had just gone through without caring about anyone. You wouldn't have felt this bad. So I don't get it. You really did everything the right way. Why did things still end up like this? Why? Is life really unfair? Say, what if I told you I knew a way to get a better end? You'll have to load your save file and, well, in the meantime, why don't you go see Papyrus and then Undyne? It seems like you could have been better friends. Who knows? Maybe she's got the key to your happiness. See you soon. Okay, I'm gonna do just that. Okay. Continue. I'm gonna have to fight Asgore again. I'm gonna have to fight Asgore again! I still take a break in between then and there. I'll probably save and then go and handle everything. I feel like I took the long way. Yeah, I took the long way, didn't I? That's fine. Yeah, because there's this elevator.
Not really all the time, because I'm about to start taking a break. So, I'm getting to the next save, to a save point so I can do the next thing, and then I'm going to take a break, because I just finished the game, and I'm going to try to get the true pass to ending by going through and rebattling the last two guys. And talking to Undyne and Papyrus and everything. Wait, hold on. Is there a save point right outside their house? No. I'll also do Tem Village when I get back. Um, but that's gonna be all for tonight. Um, I think I'm gonna take a break, and I will start back at this tomorrow. Until then, bye-bye.